Hey folks, yet another messy day across the valley. The clouds are still here, the drizzle, the light rain, the messy stuff, the overcast conditions. None of that changing. You see rain moving south to north across the area as we speak. Every once in a while, there's actually rain out there. It's not just misty drizzle. And down in Mexico, see some yellow kind of embedded within that. It's actually decent rain down there. If we zoom in a little bit closer, you can see that right now it's raining from uh, Pettersville down through Mission, down to Reynosa, all the way through McAllen, and then up toward Elsa. That's all rain moving northward. Some more between the military highway and the expressway. You go to Cameron County, spotty stuff right across the southern part of the county as well. So it's kind of a messy afternoon across the valley with cloudy skies still dominating things. Now, the good news is I think we're finally going to start to see a shift in the pattern. Temperature should finally begin to warm up. Overnight, the clouds and drizzle continue, but during the afternoon tomorrow, clouds thin. There's a break, there's a break, there's a break along the coast, maybe some breaks, so maybe some brightening of the skies tomorrow afternoon. And with that, temperature should warm back into the 70s. It's not entirely out of the question that if there's enough of a break in those clouds, if there's enough sunshine, a couple places could top the 80 degree mark. But for the most part, it's just a mainly cloudy day with some breaks during the afternoon. Friday, same kind of thing, and it warms up a little bit more yet. And you get into Saturday, and I think there's at least a slight chance for a shower, thunder shower then, as another system kind of sneaks by just to the north, but it could be close enough to trigger a couple of showers, only about a 20% probability. We're dry tomorrow, then Friday, Saturday, 20%. And you're talking maybe a thunderstorm if it happens, but when you're talking 20%, not much. Here's a look at your current temperatures right now. 64 here in the Mid Valley, 66 in Port Isabel. You move to the west. McAllen is 67. Rio Grande City at 64 this afternoon. Temperatures go nowhere tonight. We stay in the 60s all night long with clouds and drizzle. And then tomorrow, back in the 70s for the first time in about a week or so. Finally getting back closer to normal with these northeasterly winds. And again, if there's enough break in that cloud, and then maybe, maybe temperatures will get a little bit warmer than that. The normal high for this time of year is 82. We're going to have to work to get back to the next few days because of the cloud cover, but at least we are seeing a warming trend as we head through the rest of the week and into the weekend. The rest of South Texas, it's up to 74 in San Antonio. Victoria is 73, so the map's kind of upside down. Warmer temperatures to the north, cooler temperatures to the south today. Look at the rest of the state, though. 64 in Dallas, 66 San Angelo. Lumpic is 61. Front sitting right through here. A front that's going to probably wash out right through here, and that'll be about the end of it. There it is, and notice it doesn't move much farther to the south. The high, instead of moving southward, moves eastward, so we don't get any cooling from that at all. In fact, we probably end up with just a few more clouds. But again, maybe some breaks in those clouds tomorrow. High pressure eventually moves east, so the wind comes back out of the southeast as we work our way into the weekend. That helps warm temperatures up. The next front, it's not going to get here, but it could be close enough to trigger a couple of showers into Saturday morning. After that, then I think we finally, finally get some sunshine back in here for Sunday and Monday. And with that, readings are likely to warm up once again, finally getting back into the 80s for Sunday and Monday. And then another front cools off a little bit for Tuesday. Around the rest of Texas in the morning, 56 in San Antonio, Dallas, sunny skies and 47 first thing in the morning, Houston at 53 by afternoon. Everybody in the eastern half of the state in the 70s, a couple of readings in the 60s up in north and west Texas. So your first one, five vacuum weather forecast for tonight. That looks familiar, doesn't it? Clouds and drizzle, 60. East northeasterly winds tomorrow. Clouds and drizzle early, then maybe, maybe some sun late in the day, mostly cloudy skies, a high of 75. Could be some late sunshine, late showers well on Friday, 78. Saturday, if there's a thunderstorm, probably would be early and then some afternoon sunshine. Sunday and Monday look pretty good. Look at that, 82 and 90. Another front and then a little bit cooler for the middle part of next week. That is your updated First One Five AccuWeather Forecast.